Hi, Helene. Tape taping. I invited your sister over to make cookies. Helene, <laughs> are you speak Heather? Are you my to Heather? This huh? is my art major friend, Heather. Art minor. Art minor. Excuse me. Excuse me. You know what? She just doesn't need a tape. She needs a look of your face, too. <laughs> That'll make her laugh. <laughs>
realize you guys are so loved, you know. Yeah. It's probably everybody on campus says hi to us. And they know who you are. Amazon and pick me. That's us. <laughs> I saw her with Lori. I know who she is. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are the two little girls that Lori carts around everywhere she goes. Oh, those are the same. Not. Oh. Those are the ones that Wait. Lori hangs around with, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Lori doesn't have any friends up the bus. Yeah, please, come my, please. My, my friend left me. She moved to Connecticut. Connecticut is great. Yeah. That's not what I hear. Yeah, I know. Her name is Is it Connecticut for love? Oh, no, that's Virginia. Yeah, Virginia. Oh. Connecticut is something boring. No, it's not a boring state, but. It well, I thought this was a Christmas game. I didn't hear that Connecticut was great. Ba la 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 Okay, here we go. Now we're going to do our version of Carol of the Bells. I will start. No, it wasn't. Dun, 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 dun,
this guy Roy in Graphic Outfitters, me and him guys went last year, and he knows me because I was there so many times, and then they took my little card, and he goes, oh, why didn't she come this time, you know? So, like, he knows who I am, right? So I went in to get these portfolios for my graphic, or my photography class, and um, I went, I kind of went around, I didn't, I don't go right to him when I get there, hi, I'm here! Anyways, so, shh, guys, talk a little lower. So I went into the graphic afterwards to get this, and um, I walked over to the portfolios, and I'm like, oh, crud, they don't have any more of these portfolios. I'm like, Nina's going to be real upset, because I didn't want it, we didn't want to turn it, you know those cheap brown portfolios mm -hmm. that, like, drawing, I have. drawing studio has? I can't stand them. I wanted to have these ones. So, and Nina had given me money. The black ones I saw them yesterday. Yeah, and Nina had given me money to get one set, so I won't get her again. Anyway, so I, went, I couldn't find them anywhere. All I saw was these big ones. They were really nice blue ones for like $15. I was thinking about getting one of those, but I'll get one of those someday when I have money. But um, I'm looking all over, and all of a sudden Roy comes over. I really didn't expect him to come over and help me out. He goes, hi, what did you do, sneak away or something? Because I had a big graphic out. He usually asked me if I was sneaking away from home. He said, yeah. And they said, do you have any of these portfolios left? And he goes, these here. And they were right in front of my face. I was so embarrassed. It's like, oh, I wanted the attention or something. I was so embarrassed. <laughs> I couldn't believe I did that. So then I told him I needed Reese or BFK, two sheets of BFK. And every time I go in there, I ask for something, either that he doesn't know where it's at or he's got to find it or he doesn't know what I'm asking for. And I gave him a hard time. And he looked at me and goes, don't you know that it's too early in the morning to ask for something or to give me a hard time? I said, but you know, if I don't come in here and give you a hard time, you'll be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> and he laughed and went and got my paper. Mm -hmm. I guess you had to be there, but it was pretty funny. Oh, that's the end. Oh. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Just cue me when you finish the story. Okay. Oh, I, I no, I dropped my water. It was really an easy song. To Some of this wrapping paper is really gross. But it was only about... I know. But that was, it was a pretty funny. Experience. Uh, is he, is he like He's really cute, no. too. Oh, oh probably right. about 24. No. I always thought it would be. I'm through with guys. No, I'm not. Really so much. Okay, we'll go into a nunnery. Like, chapel. You got, she really, well, it hasn't really embarrassed me tonight. Because of it. Talking to that guy. When I was talking to Wes, I gave, I called and gave him a phone number, right? Okay. And he's yeah, just a good friend of mine. I mean, not even a good friend. He's just a friend. He's just an acquaintance of mine. Yeah. But um, I told him that he has to stop. He can come over sometime anytime he wants. Especially like that. next week when I'm here by myself. I, when I'm here, like all like and nobody's around, it's mm -hmm. going to be really boring. So I told him he's welcome to stop by. Are you not leaving? To go home? No, I have to stay in work. Oh. Anyways. So he asked for my phone number. He said he'd give me a call. It wasn't a priority in this way. That's nice. Yeah, but why was he talking to Heather? Did he know her? No, no, th that wasn't. Oh, guess what, Lane? Sorry, we'll watch it. No, Lewis called tonight. Okay. No, Lewis called and I wasn't here, so I called him back. Now Lewis is a good friend of mine from last year, and um, it's hard to explain Lewis. Heather or Helene knows. Me, Helene. I'm talking to you. Helene knows Lewis. Helene has talked to Lewis before and gotten and gotten. Lewis wants up. to kiss Lori. <laughs> no, I thought he, he wants to give kiss. her a big one. Whoa! That's what he said. Helene knows all about that. I think she was. I think yeah. he wants to give you a Next real one. Next time it won't be chocolate. He threatens me. If he ever did that, I'd <laughs> smack him. Right. But it's like a joke. He threatens to kiss. Anyway, don't mind Lori. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Kissing Lori is gotta be. Oh my god. You know what? Lewis would have really appreciated that. What? <laughs> no, believe me, kissing me is not on his mind. Someone else would be on his mind, but not me. Who's that? I have not at freedom to say, really. Oh, I, because I'm not supposed to know. We told us. And he doesn't Cara? know. Yeah. It's Kara? Uh-huh. Oh, well, then. Well, you can't. Kara likes him. Kara. That was really hard to figure out. I know, but like, Kara, 
they asked me not to tell him that I know. And anyways. Did they do anything? Did they look well? So Helena's probably going to do a certain type of this to Lewis. Right. Do you want his phone number? I'll let you. Hey, he told me I have to call him and collect next next time I hear a house. I'll call him collect. Helena told me I have to entertain you for a couple of hours when you guys come up. Well, um, I know how I'll entertain you. We'll sit in the back seat while the law lawyers set you the lane on that would be well, really Lena didn't say for sure she was coming out with me, so I didn't know if she's coming out. Oh. With me? Yeah. Well, anyway. I don't know when you're going. I didn't even know if you were going. You right you after New Year's, I'm coming. You to said you weren't coming at all. I know. I said I wasn't coming for New Year's. Right no. after New Year's, I'm coming up to bring you home and to bring and to go see Helene. And Helene wants you to come up. Well, I think that's what she said. Oh, I'm presuming um, that's what you gotta make sure. I mean, she doesn't want me there. I don't want to go. Well, of course, I'm you sure she's not sleeping on the floor. You're not sleeping on my bed. Nice kid. No reaction. I wanted to get a reaction. I want to get in my frame tonight so I don't have to get up early tomorrow and do it. You didn't? Why would you get a reaction? I, I had to let the paint come. You took five hours to get here. I thought for sure you got everything done. No. Scream it louder or my roommate will be able to hear you. <laughs> Probably already. Yeah. I didn't say that loud enough. Now you did it. It's just. So you're leaving now to go do no, more. No, I'm getting up to sit next to you. Do you mind? Uh, you can't sit over here because I won't hear you. Because then who? Elaine won't hear. Elaine doesn't want to hear me. Elaine yeah, doesn't, doesn't want to hear me. She's I heard enough of it. I'm gonna hit you. See, I can look here. You don't want to sit next to her anymore. Anyway. Well, sit over here. Nina's trying to study. Then I'll move presents. Yeah. Get out of here. You don't have anymore. Yeah, sure. Come on over. I'll give you one She is that. kinky. Kinky. I hate that word. Oh, she learned it from you, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, I learned it from Heather. I was talking about her learning it from you. All I have to do is blow um, my nose all the time. That's Nina's <laughs> cookie. She threw it. She threw it. She threw it. Threw it. Yeah, she package. threw it. Yeah, yeah Lori throws her back back cookie. Oh, whoops, this is closed. Oh, yeah, it's really no, almost right it out loud. Don't yes, read it out loud. I would have to rewind the tape. Mm -hmm. did pretty good. She'll like it, though. Yeah. She's going to die when she sees all these. I have, like, all these things all for her. Right no, just this and this and this and this. And this. And you. And I have something else yet. But see, like, she sends me things in the mail, and I don't yeah, that's right. You only know I like saving. I've, I've been keeping these things. And I wanted to send her and I had one tour below me. Yeah. This I've had for two months. This, this is not for so This one I'm giving her, she's gonna wonder, but this one reminds me of something, a piece of art yeah. she did, this one. This is not for my boyfriend, but now I can't do that. Is he in Boston? Yeah, he lives where I live. Hub, have a ground and box of Kleenex and bring them over to me. You look like you're bored. Hub, how about getting these last one? Yeah, she'll do that for you because you got her gloss. You got her what? Mm. <laughs> I was thinking hey, you got a laugh. <laughs> you're getting it. You're getting yours that way too. <laughs> well, Kleenexes are easier to throw than glasses of water. Think? No, glasses of water is just. I have a hole in my crotch. Oh, she's gonna be grossed out. Line my nose. Well, you better say that louder so we make sure Helene hears What? You have a hole in your crotch. No, I said. <laughs> You told me. Well, yeah. She just told me that yeah, Laurie has a hole in the crotch. And he's fine. Shut up. <laughs> she has Lori. Lori hasn't changed, has she, Lee? Clothes off. Personality. Personality. You guys. <laughs> I love you all so much. I mean, I just. Do you pound my language? Your grammar, yes. Grammar? Blow it out your left ear. I like my sister says, go suck an egg. Ooh. Heather, I'm going to send these to her. Okay? I'm going to make sure she doesn't open more than one a day. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five. The tape? Six. I'll have to keep them in my room then, huh? I want to know. Oh, you mean not? Uh, maybe I'll send it home with you and then I want to sleep. They're like... I haven't decided whether I'm going to send it with you or send them home. Or send them in the mail. 
Nobody else will come over and talk to you. I'll talk to you because I'm ignorant.
But that yeah. actually, it's usually opposite though. Usually girls like want a career and then they meet a man and they say you get the career. I know. I want to go out with someone for six years before I can get married. Six years? Well, I've been, I went out with people three years and... It'll be And that wasn't long enough. You know what'll happen to you? Same thing that'll probably happen to me. You'll meet a guy and a year later you'll be married. How old were you when you met him, Lori? Seventeen. I just turned sixteen. Didn't you want to get married when you were eighteen? I was fifteen. No, I didn't want to get married. That's why I didn't. When you were eight? Oh. I went to school. to you? No. Well, in a roundabout way. I can't. It's hard to explain without talking about the story. It was kind of presumed. Yeah. But Hot stuff, huh, honey? You've only heard this five hundred times, I bet, huh? Friend Lori always yes. told her about Dave. She was getting pretty sick and all I talked about was Dave my freshman year. Oh, don't don't tell and me your sophomore the drill. year when Helene knew you. Do you have huh? any friends? And your sophomore year when Helene knew you. <coughs> I've talked you, about him last year. Do you have any friends? Did you totally ignore them? When I went with Dave, with yeah. we just did everything together. We went. Yeah, I, I ignored a lot of. She'll treat her friends like no, because she's because she she doesn't know how to handle. I learned a lot from it. My sister, my sister was really funny because that's why I broke up with Dave. It's like, now I have a sister back. And, you know, like, she spent a lot of time. That was just the well, opposite. I, I spent a lot of yeah. time with my sister. And she's, her boyfriend's always around. But he's like my brother, so I like them a lot. That's how Jeff is, but still, Beth doesn't. But they've been going out for six years, but it took me three years to get used to them. Oh, this easy. is for the lane, too. Your sister and Roger? Yeah. Roger. Well, I don't listen to this soap opera names. Roger and Robin. <laughs> so, my brother's name's Keith. You missed the facial expression. You needed to see it. Isn't that soap opera? <gasps> oh, Roger. Whoa. That sounds disgusting. Robin. They don't do that oh, Robin. Well, they do, but... Me and, me and Dave were, did not. I mean, if we... <clears throat> oh, you did? Well, of course you did. You went, oh, dang. Oh, no. Shut up. You should have said it. Roger no, I mean, Robin. we didn't do it in front of it. I mean, if we were going to kiss. Oh, but you did it. What did you do? If we were going to kiss, we weren't going to kiss. <laughs> I just did it in private. I mean, if we were going to kiss. I did it in private. Oh, yeah. The we privacy did it in their own bedroom. In their own bedroom. The privacy of their own bedroom. No, his. <laughs> Not his bedroom. at my house. His water bed. His double bed. No, he doesn't have a water bed. Oh, his even even better than his single bed. No, I have his single bed. Yeah, his twin bed. He's married. Okay, then you can't. Made for twins. His itsy bitsy bed. Yeah, with, with, with the comforter and the yeah, electric blanket. Yeah, it's getting really disgusting, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's it's better. okay. So now <laughs> Dave is married and happily married. <clears throat> That's true love, you know. Happily married? <laughs> no, they, they Someone well. I wish Peter well, even though he's a jerk. But, yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, Dave always wanted to get married. That's what he's doing right now. I mean, he's just like my sister. He wanted How, to get married. How? When did he meet this girl? <clears throat> he met the girl a year after, two years after we... Girl. And then they get married to her a year later. It's been four years. I can't. After I would have to with someone. Together. I married them after a year. A, well, maybe I, I probably would. I could. Right, Lori, did they get a Jeep accident together? Yeah, they, they probably brought them closer. A what? <laughs> they were in his Jeep when it flipped. Oh. Yes, trauma yeah, brings people closer humor. together. That's all I remember about that book. <laughs> I, I had a fit. He's at cabin with Carla. Her, at her parents' hunting cabin. I was so upset because he always went to my dad's hunting cabin. I lived through it. My goodness. She's an old woman of the world Even after now. you broke up with her. Bruised and hardened. It was hard, but... I mean... Better to have loved and lost. No, bull. sir. No. Bull. No, no, bull. That is bull. <laughs> no, I, I think is. it's true. I did I never loved. I feel like it was Oh, come on. Now you have something to complain about before you did it. <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> See, that's all girls ever talk about. I just sit here. It's kind of fun. I can make fun of people, and they can't say anything to me. They can't say, well, you and so-and-so. What about G-A-R-Y? What about? Yeah, what about Gary? You what know what he said Gary? to me? I was walking in, into the building, and he goes, hello. And I go, hi. And he goes, am I in? And I'm like, what? And he goes, am I in with her? What does that mean? Well, you didn't tell her what happened. When we were in Philly, he came over to the door, and he talked to her. Oh, yeah, About he talked to her. He goes, so where's Heather? He goes, where's Heather at? And I said, Philly. He goes, no, 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 no. Where's she at? With me. And I'm like, who's supposed <laughs> to He asked her what's, what I'm thinking. What's in her mind? Like, she's supposed to, how does she want us to 
me. She has talked to the guy, guy but I'm not sure. Right. Wait, she wants a relationship. Guy? Gary, yeah, and the he's curly head who got up in chapel the one day. He preaches to Oh, Gary Klinger. No. No. Is no, is that it? Yeah. Gary Klinger? So. Maybe it is. Awesome. <laughs> he, yeah, Heather Klinger. <laughs> I am not like marrying it. him. It sounds like five thousand. Sounds like that sounds bad. I'm sorry, Gary Sounds like Star Trek. The Klingons. Klingons. <laughs> Klinger, I think of MASH, right, Helene? <laughs> Last year I watched MASH every night, almost. I remember, you and your tater tots. Which <laughs> I always had to take out of the air. <laughs> Helene would always come over and we'd have tater tots and we'd watch we MASH. I always made those And then she'd smash. sleep on my couch and get stuck. <laughs> get stuck. Say, get stoned. <laughs> my sister would. <laughs> yeah, how'd you hear that? Helene, you got stoned. So, Helene, you see? It's no, okay. It tots. <laughs> yeah, I put, put the tater tots. It was in the ketchup. <laughs> no, hot brownies. <laughs> and that's the ketchup, hot tatas, hot tots. Hot tots! No, oh, these guys. Hot tots. My friend was her senior. Hot, hot tots. My junior year in high school. Go on. We yeah, don't I mean, need to do another whole take. It's 1038 at night. Well, bye. Well, bye what? Bye what? She means bye, like goodbye. Be quiet a minute. I thought I heard noise. I'm she's probably going to hear music. PRA. No, I th she's probably going to hear music on while we're talking, too. Oh, you guys don't know the guy down, right down at Custodial. He has this answering service, and it's so funny because when you in it. Can we call it and listen to it? He's probably home. Oh. But when you. Do you know the song? Da, da, da? No, we don't know that. You You're the inspiration? You're the inspiration. Do you know how that starts? Da -da 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 -da. I can't do it because I'm on an orchestra. But that's how it is on his answering service. It's the beginning of that song. And then when they start to sing, he starts to talk. It's so cool. It really is cool. I guess I'll call it what he's doing. Um, Kat, and, you know Kevin McKay? Yeah, Kevin uh, his answering machine, they, the one they have in their apartment. Somehow it works where it comes on and they say hi. And it doesn't do anything for like a full minute or so. And so you're sitting there talking away. So blah, 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 blah. And then finally it comes on. This is a recording. Ha! Old you! <laughs> <laughs> We're not home right now. Ha! <laughs> don't you feel stupid? Is that what it says? No, I don't, something, something like that. I don't know exactly what it says. I don't talk. I just say, hi. Like, no, she just says, if you ever call the dorm and she answers, she's going to go, hi, I'm God speaking. It's so funny, whenever you do that, you go, I sit there and watch and you go, Heaven, God speaking. <laughs> God. This, this is heaven. I am God. Heaven, <laughs> God speaking. No, Dave no. Zerka picked up the phone. I mean, he, I answered the phone. It was him. Oh. Who's Dave Zerka? The chaplain. 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 The This boy got through to you and I'm like, yeah, okay, what do you want? He goes, um, Teresa. Teresa? Teresa Martin. <clears throat> uh, I already had to. You don't like her? <coughs> no, I'm not as well, right? <coughs> what, where, where do you live? <coughs> <coughs> hey, gonna live there if she didn't get a divorce. Why do like something like that? Want me to say what it is? What, that? Okay. Well, it doesn't oh. matter. She'll probably get it by the time she gets it. I don't know. She'll like anything if it's from... <gasps> L'Oreal! <gasps> Probably love me the most. I abuse her more than I do anybody else, and she loves me more than anybody else. Oh, that doesn't Second follow. is Nina. <laughs> Nina takes a lot of abuse from me. No, I. Huh. <laughs> well, I am going to put a kink in your theory. Well, you hurt the ones you love. Why? I take a, quite a bit of abuse from you, and I have never said that I love you. <laughs> I don't think you said. take much abuse from me. I think when you two get together, you have a party abusing me. Yeah. You too. <laughs> oh, that thing up there? <laughs> well, let's just... Break. Break my swimming.
come out and go, this is why I want to move to Hoffman. Hoffman. No, she can no. take uh, Wait, I'll I'll go. Go. Here with Chill Oh, no, Lori, this wouldn't be anything like what we used to do. Okay, we're going to be louder then. Those other nights? <clears throat> Hey. Yeah, the other night, really you guys, it was so much, it was so funny. She would be in there sleeping and she'd sleep through it all. Me and Andrew would be throwing these nuts back and forth. <laughs> they got these nuts. What kind of nuts were in it? Brazil nuts, Brazil. walnuts, pecans, TV screens still there. Filberts. Filberts that look like little acorns. Anyway, we'd be throwing these back and forth, right? And she'd sleep through it all, and all of a sudden, I took a towel and I went to Andrew over here and she goes, ah! And I go really laugh. She sleeps through it. I'm like, I can't believe this. But the funny thing is when we ran into our room. <laughs> about that. Okay, this is what happened. One night, Angie and Dawn went out to a hockey game and they weren't going to get back until like 2 o'clock. We were trying talking. to write our papers. We were trying to write these papers that were due. Ha, ha, ha. Overdue. Overdue, right. <laughs> and um, so we toilet papered their room, right? We toilet papered it really good. <laughs> Nina's an expert on this. Anyways, we toilet papered the room, and then we put a sign on the door, and we sat at the table with all the lights out, waiting for them to unlock the door, because we locked the door and everything. <laughs> we heard the sign. <laughs> we, <told you. laughs> we were so petrified. So finally we calmed ourselves down, and when it really happened, I was like sitting on the chair with my feet up on a little chair. I, I put myself. my feet up. <laughs> I put my knees up. Bang, it's the kitchen table. The kitchen table went two inches off the ground. <laughs> I wanted to nap, but I didn't want to because, like, they were, like, getting their keys out. And we had a plan. She turned off the light. I looked in there to make sure it was them. We both ran into the room, right? <laughs> well, I got up after I banged my knees. I was laughing so hard. I looked in the thing and didn't even see anything out there. I looked out, but I didn't see enough, but I heard them at the door. We ran into the room. We were finally quiet enough. Nina bumps the cart in there and wakes me <laughs> Oh, I hurt my knees so <laughs> <laughs> That's not the best part of the story yet. So well, Nina goes, I said, we got to hide, we got to hide, we can't just sit here. So Nina calls up in her bed, and I crawl back in my little koopy hole back there. Because I didn't want to get up on my bed. <laughs> That's funny, <laughs> Not yet, not yet. And then they come in, and they go in their room, and they start talking. Nina goes, what are they saying? I said, I don't know. So I go by the door, and I put my ear by the door so I can hear everything they're saying. You know, they're laughing. They get their camera out and everything like this. And then... And then someone comes up to me, I said, Nina, not yet, and I hold her hand, and here was Mary. <laughs> or I looked in bed, and Nina's in bed, I'm like, scared to death out of me. Here was Mary, she had to go to the bathroom. Cause we she wasn't her. really awake. She, she wasn't was. really awake. So she, she's like, like, she scared me to death, because here she is, and I'm like, not yet, Nina. I look up, and Nina's in bed, and I'm like, who is this? And I looked up, and I realized it was me, or Mary, but it scared to death out of me. And there I am, laughing in the and corner. And Mary thought that was me. Mary thought it was me. Now, look, so this Mary walked outside the door, and Dawn thought it would be me, so Dawn takes a picture of her, and Mary gets really upset, like, I'm in my pajamas, I look like a mess, right? Mary gets a picture taken, then she goes into the bathroom, and she didn't know. And then she comes out, and she said, Lord, she was, me and Nina had a, a big she, argument. She that, got me on my bitch. Yeah, me, me and Nina had a big argument that night, so, and we were, like, screaming back and forth. But everything was fine by the end of the night. Of course, we were laughing and crying like crazy. And, um, so, she went and told Dawn, or Mary, and and Dawn that me and Nina were screaming at each other and now Nina's in bed or now Nina's sleeping on the floor and somebody's in Nina's bed or yeah, something she like that. Was in my bed. And so then she, she came up to me and she looked at, at the bed <laughs> and she and she said, I was just in your room before I said it was me. She goes, No, you were on the floor in front of the door. I said, No, no, no that was Lori. She said, No, that was you. I said, No, that was Lori. I've been up here the whole time. She said, No, that was you on the floor and someone else was in your bed. I said, Okay, Mary. <laughs> And then I said to her, Mary, shh, shh, because she saw me back in the corner. I said, Lori's there right now. So Angie and Dawn come back and forth in this room, and Angie comes in the room and goes, you get Nina, I'll get Lori. <laughs> you know? This is before Mary told me anything. This is when he, Mary was so in bed. And then they walk back out, and then Mary gets up and all this stuff. And then but they come we back laughing. in, we and I was in that room laughing hysterically. I was like, and Ange comes in, and I'm pretending I'm asleep, and I have all my clothes on my glasses on, <laughs> and I'm on top of the cupboard, and she goes, are you okay? She th thinks that Nina's crying, yeah. Nina's laughing, she thinks Nina's crying, she because says, where's Lori? I said, oh, she went out for a bit, <laughs> something, I said, I don't she, even and remember. And she said, is Lori mad? And you said, no, and <laughs> she's laughing her head off, right? And as she's laughing her head off, I'm in the corner Hi. laughing, and Ange never saw us. It was great. Hi, Ange, I know. Hi. 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 Say hi to Helene. We're getting what happens in this apartment in the middle of the night. Hi, Helene. <laughs> Anyways, 
That's all I need. My sister, don't I look like her? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> square. Anyway, so eventually. Where's Helene? Helene's on the tape right now. Look at her! When she laughs, Pella is on the couch. Acting like a maniac. Anyways, it was so funny. The and, air? Then, and then you guys. You got the R? Shut up. And then they came in. And finally, they said, She's in here somewhere. So they start looking for me. I said, and then all of a sudden they I said, I've been here the whole time. And it scared the hay out of them. And it was so funny. And then Ange comes with me, and towards me, with a glass of water. And it gets me in whatever. Right in front of Mary's closet, this big water bottle. You know, Mary's back in bed. She went to sleep. <laughs> Mary's back in bed and slept. Everyone laughing at you too, in our room. Oh, it was so funny. Yeah, she's the one. No, Dawn's one that got up last time. Mary's one that one that So does Ange. Oh, she doesn't The one who just asked where Helene was. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I didn't know why. When I come, she's usually here. Um. So, I mean, you need some roommates next year. You guys get a room together in an apartment still? Uh, -huh. we don't know what we're doing. You don't know if you're going to be on speaking terms. Yeah, we'll be able to speak each other. Maybe that's all about. <laughs> I'm just teasing. Thank you so much. It's so funny. We get along around a lot. Thank you. Me and you? We yeah. didn't use to fight freshman year, never. We'll fight. Because we talked, we didn't need to fight. Smack. Smack. We'll be rolling around yeah, last, we're year, <laughs> last year. Last <laughs> year. Last year, Brian Shive said, Where are you and Lena Rumi? He said, Fry goes good. You're on the opposite end of campus. I won't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Say goodbye to me. Were you talking to us before? Uh, 
my God. My fault. I wrapped these presents and now I don't know what to do. Somewhere after my freshman year, I had a job at 6 o'clock in the morning, which means that I had to leave for 11, oh. 20, quarter to 6. I was getting to do that. But, but then I started going to school. I, I started taking a summer course. And so I was working until till around 12 o'clock, but I was going to school from, I had to catch a bus before 6 o'clock to get to school by 8 and, and then get to work later on. So, and I usually had to do my studying for the school in the morning, so I would get up at 3 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I used to go to bed at 9 o'clock. What school did you go to? How old were you? Well, you better. That was my summer after my freshman. What were you going to summer school fine. for? What are you going to I took Spanish. Two semesters of Spanish in six weeks. <laughs> Two semesters in six weeks? I haven't had enough weeks? time now. And yeah, six credits. Wow, that's pretty good. And it probably didn't cost beans, did it? it that, yeah. It cost yeah. less for the six credits than it cost me to take three here. Did they, didn't they transfer? Yeah, they did. Then why did you take Greek? I had Greek already. <laughs> See, I took two semesters of Greek. Oh, this is after your first semester. Two semesters of Spanish. I was trying to decide which one to finish with, and I decided on Greek. She's been every major in the book they offer here, all 45 of them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and she's also been every combination of major and minor that there is. Every, all 45. <laughs> that includes mechanical engineering. <laughs> Have you been an English major? That's what she was last year for a while. I might change my major to I. I.
Why does he what? Why does he talk that way? I'm, talk I'm so distressed over things. He doesn't. Who? He was fine in our lecture. His sex lecture with us <laughs> was fine. I don't know. What, why? He just he can't did. handle sex on <laughs> He's telling them 36 calories. What? He did. He goes, he said. Well, girls, um, if you'd like calories. to know, if, you're, if you guys... And we all yeah. laughed. And then later, he goes, said something like, you guys shouldn't really be involved. No wonder why you all laughed. Or something like that, and we all were, like, really quiet. What? He uh, said... Really he was talking about sex. Yeah. He was talking about oral sex, I think. Mm -hmm. And he goes, and if, if any of you want to know, that's 36 calories. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh. Okay. And um, we all laughed. And then later... He goes, said something like, it seems even, oh, then, then he was given statistics, 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 stats about, um, <laughs> on tape, not that one. <laughs> he's given stats about how many people are virgins in Christian colleges. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. And he goes, he goes, it's really surprising, maybe that's why you all laugh when I said that joke about 36 calories. And we were all really quiet. We're like, hmm. Yeah, but it makes you think. That, bo that lecture bothered you? Not for me. She he didn't do good. anything with ours. He did. Apparently, he gave big ours overhead, big really blow up disgusting. overhead pictures of the he anatomy. Did, like, we, he didn't do he anything said, with us. He said ours was boring. Things. He like. <laughs> the twelve I, steps. I want to be sitting next to Mark that. that you guys that should day. take human sexuality. You'd love it. No, I wouldn't. Um, what was the thing you do on the first day? Somebody How do you told die? The first day. Oh, you have to draw each other. You have to draw the opposite sexes. Show oh. anatomy. You do not. Yes. On the chart, on the blackboard, no less. You have to why? go to the blackboard and draw it. But why? That, who was who's taking it? Janelle. It wasn't. I didn't. Such an enlightening conversation. I can't remember. Really, it's on tape too. Well, I would just like, take my drawing board and. Just <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you like, art major. We probably make a comment too. We think, well, all right, you art major. Just draw the picture of David, the, the statue of David. No, not the whole body. No, well, just blow up the one section. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> you take it in. Here, here's my picture. Boom, boom, <laughs> boom, boom. Right up onto the chalkboard. Oh, my. So, um, Can you photograph it instead? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Nina. <laughs> 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 freshman looking, I'm like, I can't look at this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, they don't have meals. Oh, it's Do like they have new models here? No. no. Oh, I don't feel that good. This is Messiah College. That, that's so ridiculous. That's <laughs> not so loud. That's ridiculous. Well, Mary, yeah, we're discussing nude models in case you want to. Well, why don't you Do you know what they would do to Messiah College's board if the art department had They would have no money. The they parents would all write. they missing out on a lot. Well, People who are That's ignorant. why you go to Philadelphia and study this. People who are ignorant to art don't understand that. My dad would but never understand that. Why would we be taken on if we were ignorant to it? No, but that, not We're talking us. about the people who support the college and uh, give us their money. Yeah, like the parents, they, they find they out. They actually be ignurant. Oh, oh, if something does go wrong, they're definitely ignorant. That's why we can't have dancing, because the they parents. They have kids. I'm sorry. In the 20s, when? They were born. They were 40. They were 40. These people. These brethren Christ people. Cool out. They're nice people, some of them, okay? They just cool have old fashioned views. Mm. Silence. <laughs> so, Lane, um, let's think of something to talk about now. What other deep conversation? We gotta watch the tape because we have to well, sing to our We got sex, Eleven boyfriends. <laughs> what else have we gotten? <laughs> Crazy. Well, we've done plenty of music in ours. Nudes, yeah. Well, I think. Shall we, we just discuss politics now? No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, arts and the poem. Oh, yeah, it's according to Hill. Did you see? I, oh, I'm going to get a nap out of that later. <laughs> <laughs> time. Huh? Guys, uh, Boy, you just read your huge book again and you won't have to go to the Hill Grammar. <laughs> Did you do that? No. 
We had a discussion about that in Pearl City. We tried to have a discussion on it. Mr. Prescott actually had a discussion with himself. <laughs> Oh, he is. And then what, tell and the then story about what he did. I did. It was great. I love the way you tell the story. And then you go, and then you go, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> what cracks me up is him. <laughs> what cracks me up is him and his finger. Do you know that he almost chewed his finger off? Yeah. Well, I went into it. He did it with the saw. With his teeth. The grinder. The grinder. Yeah, the the grinder. new grinder. Oh, Helene, do you yeah, remember was, last year the grinder it in was for women. sculpture yeah, that he said he was going to get a little grinder for the women to use? He almost chewed his finger off with this other, this new saw for women. Oh, that cracks me up so bad. Well, that's because of the way Steve handed it to you. I should tell you the story about his the button. I, I've never heard happened. of the guy's screen. But he was so used. <laughs> 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 and then the next one, he's trying to use Oh, and it just came. Oh, oh. <laughs> like. I walked into class the other day and I said to him, to one of the drawing classes, I said, how do you did to your finger? It's pretty stupid, huh? I'm like, oh, you just did that in front of this whole class. I felt so bad and he just looked at me like, thanks. He's so nice. And then he came down later and I said, so what are you going to do to your fingers next year? He got really mad and he goes, shut up. Because last year he fell with his coffee cup. He tripped. And he wouldn't you. let go of his coffee cup. He hung on to it. <laughs> so he cut his finger and had to have like 14 stitches. He tripped. His hand. He walked. <laughs> yeah, this is so funny. He put the pictures on the wall. And he walked up and had him down the triple. He never looked. He'll over the same box. He'll go on the triple. And he won't move it. And then, no, he'll put his coffee cup. And then when he talks, and the spit goes from one note. shows and they're holding hands. I think that's so neat. Mr. and Mrs. Forsyth never show much affection. I know. But you know what? The other day, I caught them. And you know what was so You caught funny? them? Where? Doing what? what? King is. He, she was out in the hall standing looking at a poster and he walked by her and he either pinched her or tickled her or something and she goes, don't stop it, it's in the middle of the hall. And literally, and I don't, she looked around to see if anybody was laughing and I kind of like ducked back like and I nabbed my head off. It was so cute though. And like, he ran down the hall after he did it, like, he ran away from her. He was just so cute. Oh, it was so neat. I love to see that. I think he's cute. He is. I did. One of my friends has a roommate that says, said something like, I mean, this is really bad, but she goes, is he married? Yeah. Does he have any kids? Yeah. Darn, I won't have an affair with a guy who's married and has kids. <laughs> I don't think I would either. I can't believe you guys are serious. Okay, we talked about sex, um, affairs, affairs. Affairs. sex, and art. Nudity. Sex and when your I hope she didn't let your mom listen to this. I know that's what I'm thinking. No, <laughs> no, my mom's cool. No. Is that mom? <laughs> We so probably be there. Yeah, we used to talk like that. Yes, you, you know what? You'll probably be there when she listens to this so that you can die laughing. Yep. That'd be funny. Who's this for? I'm having these gifts and I don't know who they're for. <laughs> I'm not gonna know what's in Why don't you just do it? I don't want to get up. You know when I get up at 11 o'clock? You know what? It, you'd be in a better mood. I think my class is at 10 20. I think I would have to stand up. And Heather's so proud of herself. She thought that was good. <laughs> is it my um, alfalfa here? Yeah. I have no, I have one. Like, you don't have enough little pillows in here. Don't get comfortable with leaving. <laughs> you can't leave. You We're just yelled at me and said, Are oh, you following me around here? Because you're not going to go. <laughs> well, then you can stay here and help me finish this. No! Someone's got to stay here and help me. How much time is there? What do you mean, help me do what? I, 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 I offered you to go before Christmas. Yeah, no, and I you sat here and I went to give you a present. <laughs> How in the world long is this tape? 90 minutes of blabbering? She's not You do that very well. <laughs> blabbering? Do what very well? Blabbering. 
Well, I'll ask her, and if she says it was boring, each I won't do it again. She won't. She'll, she'll, she'll die over Amber. You're right. She will. She'll, 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 she'll stop rewinding. 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 She'll stop rewinding.